Alright, you are tuning into Moo's Gameplay and this is Take It To The Man Part 3. I am at Chapter 4 now so we have to find Dr. Egglesworth. So where is this Dr. Egglesworth? I guess we'll be making a long trip there, yeah? He's the one who took your sacred thingamabob! Thingamabob. I know because he has a stupid haircut. I don't forget a haircut that dumb. Agent 23 reporting in. We may have a positive on our target. Instructions. Get him. So I guess I have to escape the- oh my god, Wait, he's chasing is me. This real? Am I being chased uh, by these jerks? Or am I really just going totally nuts right now? Makes sense. When I catch Ray, I'm gonna get, get a free spin for me. I'm a guest. In the company's spinning. Not that this what about this guy? I saw a haircut that dumb 15 years ago, and it made me the man I am today! Jeez, that was an incredibly dumb haircut. <laughs> What could a haircut do to make you dumb? Freaking retard. I so what is know, it? Oh, it's just so sad. Oh, Dr. Eggersworth, if only you had it taken a death of your father so high and fallen into deep depression. I'm glad you're seeing Dr. Brom. I'm also glad I'm seeing Dr. The hour. Take as long as you need, Dr. Egglesworth. So Dr. Egglesworth is out. So who shall I see? Love jumping again. Oh my, oh, why is he here? Oh shit. He keeps coming back. Later, uh, possibly imaginary suckers. Later. I am at a graveyard. There have been any zombies around. That's a gentleman. Who loves digging six foot the oars? This is basically the perfect shot for me. Except for the constant and omnipresent threat of a spooky hunt. Action. Dag it! I'm dead now. Hey, that's an inconvenience for me, but it's not going to shut down my practice. There's still tons of people out there who need lobotomies. Stay away from me with your lobotomies, man. So you're not as scary as I was expected. I'm not scary. I'm a lobotomist. And it's the only way to cure what ails you, Sonny. A few cups, a few slips, and you won't have a care in the world. Who is these ghosts? That's a chip. Oh, no, not you. Alright. When there's talking about your issues, I'm a soul of anything. Action speaks louder than words. And that action is pulling out brain parts. What the hell? Alright, I'm gonna make a move now. Mr. Copy, Copy. Oh, this guy again. Oh, no, my. He keeps teleporting. Oh, he gotta chase me again. Oh, my God, no! Alright, thank you, Mr. Copy. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I got a perfect job. Oh, 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 shit. Yeah. Hey, those guys are snappily dressed. Some enemies will think I'm probably pretty smart. smart. Maybe. <laughs> well, I should have not stayed up all night. last night eating burritos. I have no. Pretty good about staying up all night eating burritos. Oh, man. Why would you like put this. <laughs> Sweet. This sticker makes him <laughs> sleepy. Oh, I probably don't have to uh, I should make up. a move. That is nice. Oh, this is heavy. Gotta get to that psychiatrist stat. So where is that psychiatrist? Wonder Ween Wonder what? Wiener? Let me get Wonder Wiener. Whose Wiener is wandering? Oh, Dr. Brown, putting the screw back in, no refunds. Mm. 
Is there anything here that I need to know? Yeah, Dr. Brom. Uh, excuse me, yeah, doctor? Um, doctors? Dr. Brom, I can't go back to work. I just can't. Dad hated how I practiced my profession, and now that he's gone, we'll never reconcile. There's no closure left for me. I'll never be able to talk to him again. Mm hmm. He doesn't look like a doctor to me at all. Sad, I guess. Mm hmm. And how does that make you feel? The sadness? No, um, like. Not happy, like I have emotions that are making me depressed. Mm hmm. And how does that make you feel? Wait, how does that make you feel? Fine, thank you. <laughs> oh, why is he asking Dr. Hey, Beck a question? Uh, I gotta help Dr. Egglesworth so that he can help me. I got If only. Oh, uh, this is Dr. Egglesworth. <laughs> Oh, I think the ghost at the graveyard wow. is his bed. <laughs> Alright, so I must find a sticker for Dr. Brom. Wait. Ah, oh, okay. I shall keep moving. Yes, I have made contact with the spirit of your dear departed wife. I haven't <coughs> departed anywhere. I can't move in the afterlife because my husband <laughs> cut off my legs. Ta da! Is she here? Can you ask her if she's mad that I cut off her legs? But she's saying that she is um, slightly frustrated by the circumstances. If I could touch him, I'd tear his legs off too! Yeah, definitely sensing some frustration. Frustration. So I need to find legs for all I these ghosts. To kill a wheelchair. Here I am. I should have How am I? The ghosts really do exist. And how incredible that they all want to talk with my paying customers. At least this ghost knows the language. I'm so tired of being bothered by cavemen ghosts from thousands of years ago. Whoa! Uh, but insanely accurate. Can I apologize for getting off your legs? I should ask her if she knows where I put my rabbit. I haven't seen him for weeks. Rabbits don't just disappear. Oh, wait, no. I made him disappear and then turned him back. Okay, yeah, note yourself. Stop by a picture on the way home. Just had a great time. Huh. Alright, I need to find some legs. Balloons for sale. I like shapes and colors. Wait, this. Oh, yeah, I could take this helium. So, who shall I bring this helium to? Ajays, the greatest show on earth. Normally, people say bullet. Oh, there's a three headed freak. Oh, I can get the middle one. Oh, come on. If my legs. Mr. Copy. Oh no, not this guy again, please. Spare me the agony. No. Alright. I'll run from them bozos. I should have 
burn, 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 Yep, Sonny. You're leaving the crowds waiting. The show must go on. Yeah, hey, a dying, a dying clown. I told you, I'm afraid of heights. And not heights once you hit the bottom. Yep, dang it. Dad, I don't want to fall to my death. Please stop hitting my hands. Next time. Oh, that, that is a fake hammer. I thought that was real. Wrong sticker. Wrong sticker. Wrong sticker. I should. And make the fire come out, and I'm inside the explosion. I confess. I cannot say the attraction of being fired out of the cannon, but I don't say the attraction of being responsible for the safety of those who do choose this path. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I shall put the fire here. Yes. All right. Oh, that was. Awesome. Uh, so it is just dead? Don't I get anything else? Wrong sticker. Yeah. Let go, I'll die. Help me, please. Yes, <laughs> I'll die. Bye bye, Daddy. Oh, great. Oh, that's second. Fully accurate fortune cookie restaurant. So, you did it? Do I need anything else? No, no. Ah, I gotta skip this. Oh, that was awesome. Uh, thing. I gotta make some progress. <clears throat> so where shall I go? Oh no, oh shit. Alright. I got this sticker. So, go to sleep. Go to sleep. No, no, no. Alright. Bye bye, sucker. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, yes, hello. Well, take a good look. Here I am, the bearded lady. The bearded lady. lady. Isn't that crazy? Yes. Doesn't that mess with your ideas of gender and beauty? I... I guess? Well, soak it up, because there's no reason. Alright, I gotta end my video here. I shall see you in my next part of Stick It To The Man. Thanks for watching, like it, favorite, share it with your friends and subscribe to me and it will help me out a lot. Thanks for watching, peace over and out.